afternoon after the AVN Awards show. It's the last day of the Adult Entertainment Expo. And we just wanted to catch up with Kehlani and see how your weekend has been, what you think of the show, how the awards went, how you feeling. It's great. Uh, I've been really feeling good up until just today. <laughs> I am a hot mess. I'm so tired and I can feel it. Like, I know I'm tired. I look tired. I'm tired. Um, but it was all worth it. Last night was such good times. Like, it was... We... With a couple of awards, man. Wicked picked up a few awards. Well deserved. I think they were great. Think, yes. Yeah, very exciting. And then we had a great after party at Rain. That was awesome. And then the first few days of signing um, has been a breeze. Everybody's really, really cool. And I've seen some familiar faces or and some uh, new fans. Which is great um, considering the economy and everybody's all, oh my god, oh my god, what's going to happen? You know what? I didn't, yeah, it, it really hasn't affected. I mean, I haven't noticed of a difference. I've actually been pleasantly surprised at like how many people have showed up. Like we've been consistently busy. Like yeah. Yeah, yeah it's been insane. Trying to walk because it's impossible because it's so busy here. Yeah. I think that's great. So I think fun. it's wonderful. Yeah. I mean, hey, let porn live. <laughs> Go porn. <laughs> yeah. Busy week ahead of you, or are you just gonna take a week off after? After show, this, or? I've got a week until Stormy Daniels directs a movie of mine. So we start shooting in a week. Yeah, I get back on Monday and I shoot the following Monday. And um, it's going to be fun. I play a sex therapist. And yeah, I can't tell you too much yet. But um, yeah, I play a sex therapist who basically like is uh, her clients are like really wacky, crazy uh, couples. I would totally go to a sex therapist if I thought she was going to look like you. <laughs> I think a lot of people would. Actually. I would love for you to be my client. I think we'll make a cute couple. I think so. So, uh, 2010 then, you got, uh, you're working out for you then? Like anything you can do? You know what? So far, it's been a damn good year. A week into it. Right. I'm pretty stoked and I, I want to see what the rest of the year has to offer. Any big Wicked Pictures projects coming up? Like any big feature films in the works? That is, I'm sure, in the works. We haven't confirmed anything as of yet, but um, we usually knock out one or two in a year. So, can't wait to see this next project. Actually, I saw an AVN story a few weeks ago about, I'm going to forget her name, one of the vice presidents at Wicked going to um, Sacramento to lobby against um, condom mandatory legislation for the entire industry. Did you hear about that? Again? Okay. Against. Because Wicked does, uh, you know, condoms yeah. only, um, which I think is fantastic. But they were saying that if condoms were imposed on the entire it could really hurt everybody for a whole lot of reasons and Wicked was like at, at the front of the lobbying process for that. Um, I haven't actually heard how it went, but you know, go you guys. I think that's awesome. Uh, yeah, you know, it, it, it's nice to, wait, she, she wanted to not she have it. not have condoms. Right. She said or to at least have a choice. Yes. You know what I mean? Exactly. And what I like is that we as, you know, being the condom mandatory company, the only ones right as of now, um, I like that we have the choice. You have the option. Uh, obviously, I'm not going to sign a contract with Wicked if I didn't want to be kind of mandatory. So that's my choice to be kind of mandatory. But there are other females out there who would choose not to use condoms, so they can work for other companies who don't have that rule. You can also work for companies, and you can personally say, "I will be do a sex scene with a condom." But yes, we heard. Oh, we, we can hurt at times. A lot of people don't want to see the condom, it like ruins it, but we also cater to a large market of couples and of a lot of other people, so it's not like we're hurting, but yeah, there is a whole other genre of people that don't even want to see the condom, there's yeah. no way. Like it, it ruins the fantasy or something. Totally. Yeah. yeah. But, like I said, not enough to hurt us, obviously. Um, Porn period.
article? Dude, hello, Whack Magazine is the shit, duh. 